read the beginning there. What? Let's say. Let's say. <laughs> oh, okay. Let's say that in seals, the dean for the length of the whiskers has two alleles. The dominant allele coats long whiskers, and the recessive allele coats both short whiskers. Good. So, uh, so let's make a key. So we're going to make the big W. Come on, pen. Big W equals what? Long whiskers. I really like messing with my cat's whiskers. It's kind of funny. They get all, like, dogs get all pissed off when you mess with their whiskers. Uh, like, try to bite you or something. But, uh, okay, so uh, what is going to be the little w? Short whiskers. Good. All right, does that make sense? Is everybody with us? Yeah. All right, so now it says, we're going to cross. It says you have one pair is a pure long whiskered. Right? Everybody see that? What is? What do you have to be to have a be pure long whiskered? What do you have to have? Who knows? Somebody different. Ingrid, do you know? You should start learning, Ingrid. Come on. Anybody new? Hey, the uh, uh, Camila. Okay. Which kind of W's? Good. Two big W's. Does that make sense? Pure. Pure means your homozygous what? In this case, homozygous what? Dominant. Good. We're going to cross homozygous dominant with, and the other is short whiskers. So what do you have to be to have short whiskers? Monica. To have short whiskers? Is short whiskers recessive or dominant? Good. Two little W's. Whoops. That's my little loop in there. Two little W's, okay? So I want you guys to go ahead and make that cross right now. I'm going to pause this for a second. Okay, so I'm assuming you guys have probably drawn the box already. And if I draw my Punnett square, whoa, not so good, square, but that's okay. I put the big W's on top. I put the little W's on the side. And then I put them together. It does not matter what order you put these W's in. Does everyone see that? I could put the big W first, it wouldn't make a difference. Now, here's where the genotypic and phenotypic ratios are the same, but a little bit different. So, <clears throat> Do we only have one type of genotype? And what is it? Okay, someone raise your hand and tell me straight up. Danny. That's the phenotype. What is the genotype? Good. Big W, little W. So we have all, for now, you can just say big W, little W. Does that make sense? Or that's four. Thank you. Any time. Four to zero. Does that make sense? It can't be four to zero because that's a. Uh, yeah. They're all big W, little W. You can just write that for now. Does that make sense, everybody? Yeah. All right. And let's go to the phenotypic ratio. We'll talk about what we do when there's not enough later. All right. In the phenotypic ratio, what do they all look like? They all have long whiskers. Wow, that is amazing, and I'm done. <laughs>